Hello my YouTube friends, today I'm going to show you how to use a Sony DSLR as a webcam for live streaming without a capture card. At the end of this I'm going to give you a huge bonus tip on using this method to make your content easier to film and edit for your videos, so be sure to stick around. Let's get to it! If you're always looking for tools, tips, and tricks to help make you a better YouTuber, subscribe to the channel and click that bell so you don't miss any new content. This process makes it easy to add your Sony DSLR as a webcam, but you need to keep in mind that you're going to need some external audio source as well, like a USB microphone or something. The USB signal we're capturing from the Sony camera does not include the audio. First, we want to go to the Sony Imaging Edge website and click here to see if your camera is compatible. If it is, you can download the software here. The links are in the description. Once you have it downloaded and installed, click here to download the piece that you'll use to capture the camera as a webcam. Once that download completes, install it. Now, in our programs, we're going to open the remote app. The software will search for your camera and when it finds it, just double click on it here. If it doesn't see your camera, you want to make sure your PC remote is selected under the USB on your camera. Turn the camera off and on again, and then try refreshing the software. It should see it now. Next, let's open OBS and add our new webcam. In any scene, click on the plus under sources and select window capture. Name your window so it's something you'll remember, like Sony webcam. Then select the Sony remote window. If you don't see it in the drop down here, be sure the remote window is not minimized. Once you have the window captured, you're going to notice it gets the entire window and we don't want all this interface stuff. So hold the alt key and crop out the interface so we just have the window of you showing. Then you can just resize it and place it wherever you want. Now all you need to do is add a microphone to your scene and you're ready to broadcast. Now for the bonus. This app lets you control a lot of the camera functions right from your computer. I use this app to adjust my camera settings and start and stop recordings right on the camera. This makes it super easy to record multiple scenes and even pre-scripted segments or videos all without moving to turn on the camera. Then when you're done you just grab the card out of the camera and your footage is all there and neatly organized in short clips to make it so much easier to edit later. If you want to see how you can turn your phone into a webcam, you should check this video out right here. If you have any questions about using your Sony as a webcam, go ahead and leave it in the comments below. And if you're always looking for tools, tips, and tricks to help make you a better YouTuber, subscribe to the channel. My name is Michael Fire Jr. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one.